Welcome to this new business building. I'm Dean Georgette Chapman Phillips. Thanks so much for joining us as we follow the progress of the construction of our new business innovation building. With us today is Perry Freifeld. He's the Northeast Regional Director for Diversified, our technology integrator for our new building. Welcome, Perry. Hi, Georgette. Thanks so much for having me. We're so excited to be part of this project. It is so amazing to walk into the building and see it come alive with technology. What's the range of technology that we're talking about within the building? So in this building, we have a state-of-the-art distance learning, presentation, and conferencing systems that allow for uh, an amazing hybrid in-person or remote experience. So the feature technology in the spaces is a direct view LED display uh, that's ultra wide, so it can show side by side or single image uh, presentation content or the far end of uh, distance learning or video conference. Wow, that is a big screen. So how early in the construction process did Diversify get involved? Yeah, so we got involved um, really starting to bid on the project about a year ago, and then we started to really work on site uh, about six months ago or so, doing some cable rough-ins, and now we're kind of in the middle of our installation process here. So we're starting to hang displays on walls, devices in ceilings. Um, we've pulled about five miles worth of cabling throughout the building so far. So we're really kind of through our install process almost complete at this point, uh, and we're going to be moving into our commissioning process pretty soon. What does that mean, commissioning uh, process? Commissioning means once the systems are installed, we're going to be testing, tuning, configuring to make sure that the systems do exactly what you need them to here. And when we're done with commissioning, we're going to do some training sessions for the, the staff and the students. And the faculty the will faculty. be very yep. happy to know that there will be training we sessions. Will, we, we will not <laughs> hand the keys over to you without telling you how to drive the car first. Uh, and then it's going to be yours to take. That is wonderful. In a classroom such as this, this configuration, I'm seeing the big screen there. I've also seen screens behind us. What do they do? Absolutely. So these are called confidence monitors. And what they do is uh, usually mirror the content that's going to be up on the large display so that uh, the lecturer can see what they're presenting without having to turn around and look back. So it really helps make it more of a seamless experience for presenting content. All right. How about the sound? Sure. Yeah, so we've got uh, ceiling speakers as well as uh, speakers at the front of the room um, to really give a, a full uh, audio experience. In addition, there's microphones installed in the ceiling as well as wireless channels of microphones. Uh, so that's going to be for voice lift, so the presenter can be heard throughout the whole room really easily, but also so that the far end, the students who are either hybrid or remote, uh, can hear the, the speaker uh, as well really clearly. Perry, as we're walking through the building, I'm seeing conference rooms and breakout rooms that are also full of technology. Could you tell us a little bit about what's in those rooms? Sure. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Throughout the whole building, you're going to find conference rooms, breakout rooms, huddle rooms that are really here to give students, faculty, staff the ability to break out for meetings, video conferences, present content. So lots of different functionalities within these rooms. We're in a great conference room now that has amazing audio capacity. Could you tell us about the technology and how you're using it in conference rooms for hybrid meetings? Absolutely. So audio technology is really important for a high quality uh, hybrid meeting experience. So for this room, we've got uh, ceiling microphone arrays and ceiling speakers that are going to allow the folks who are in the room uh, in conferences to be heard really well by the folks who are on the far end. That is so important as we're moving more and more towards the world of hybrid meetings. We're now in probably my favorite classroom of the entire building, the classroom in the round. Tell us a little bit about the technology in this room and the challenges a round room presents. Sure, so this is a really cool classroom because it has a lot of the same features that the other classrooms do. Uh, it's, it's got the ability to present content on these really nice large LED displays. It's got the ability to do hybrid or remote distance learning. However, as you'll notice, the displays are curved just like the room. So what's neat about this is it really emulates a real world business environment where a presenter is standing in the center of the room and he, has the, he or she has the ability to kind of look around and present content in every direction. We're now in the Boslin Financial Services Lab. This is the place where our students will get real world experience while still in school. Tell us about the technology in this room. 
Sure, so this room has a lot of the great technology that some of the other classrooms have. Large LED display for presenting uh, and distance learning, cameras, microphones, speakers. But the coolest part about this space from a technology standpoint is a 23 foot wide LED stock ticker that we're gonna be installing in the ceiling over here, um, which is really gonna emulate a, a real world trading floor system. I love that idea because it gives a sense of place to, to the room. It says to everybody, Lehigh does finance. One of the exciting features of this magnificent lobby is a video wall. We're going to use that to display the history of Lehigh business, our alumni, our students, and our faculty. How is that going to work? Yeah, so this is a really cool video wall system that we're going to be installing. So it's actually built out of six individual displays that are portrait mounted and put together as one single video wall system. So it's going to be a nice large image that's going to have a touch interactive frame around it. So uh, people will be able to walk up to it and interact with the custom content that's being developed. Uh, more than one person can stand at it at, at one time and interact with their area of the display that they're touching. Thank you so much, Perry, for taking us on this very exciting technology tour of the new building. Thanks so much for having me. It's been so much fun. Don't forget, hit that subscribe button so you won't miss an episode. Thank you so much for joining us and see you next time on this new business building.